this guy here, that's me. And this is how I made it to AKC National Agility Championship Finals. Good morning, Doggy Dojo. It is early here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, where I am standing in front of the Ford Truck Arena for AKC National Agility Championship. I'm so excited to be here. It's gonna be a great time. I'm glad to bring you guys along for the journey as well. It's gonna be amazing. Daisy and I, um, Daisy is 10 years old, border collie that I own. We have been competing all year long to be here at this point, and we're excited to bring you along for the ride. As we go about this journey, you're gonna see in-depth view of the whole process and seeing how to get your dog to this point where you can come to AKC Nationals with your dog. So if you have any questions about that, feel free to put them down below in the comments. Otherwise, we'll see you guys in just a bit. So today is Friday and it's kind of a warm up day. What we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be doing some warm up courses with our dogs. Currently we're in the process of doing some walkthroughs. Basically what that means is you have a little bit of time, about eight minutes to walk the course and make sure that you know exactly where you're going to be turning or crossing and know exactly where to put yourself to help your dog run through the course. After the walkthroughs, we get started and we run our dogs and we see how we do. So now that I've finished up my walkthrough, I'm heading back over to our crating area. And this year, it's kind of nice. Last year, we were in the free crating area where you just kind of put your crate down in a big open building area. This year, check it out. We have a whole stall a whole area, I want to call it a suite, not a stall, stall suite, we can call it that, for ourselves and our puppies here. Um, it's our first time having our stall to ourselves. I think we came a little unprepared because everybody else has like tables and couches and jacuzzis, I'm just kidding, but they have a lot of stuff in their stalls, including signs for their dogs up there. So next time, We'll be ready for that. I have to get my dog ready to go. We're the first group to run. I'll check you guys after that run. So we have about an hour before our next run, so of course we have to go shopping. And we also brought a special pup along. It's these types of events that get us dog people in trouble with our finances because of all this amazing stuff that you can buy. It's crazy. So let's go check it out. <laughs> I'm here in Planet Blue Dog. They have so many cool products in here. One of the one of the best products I love here is the Herd of Vest, but I, last year I got this right here. This was great for your agility dogs. It's a back on track coat. It's a therapeutic mesh coat. Keeps your dogs warm um, before their run. You can see a lot of right things here, just like that. So if I were you, check out, if you ever see Planet Blue Dog um, at one of your dog shows, I definitely stop because they are such nice people. They have great and wonderful, fun products. I definitely check out planetbluedog.com for more information. One of the fun things to do for your dog and a dog agility is actually making your own custom 
leashes or tugs, and it's a, it's a tugs is one of the best to do it. They have so many different designs. Look at all this stuff. They, we picked one up for Jade and we're excited to get that one. We've gotten them before. They, they hold up very, very well. It's a fun thing to do. You should check it out. Um, if they're at your dog show as well, I definitely recommend them as well. Yes. Good job. Here goes another dog. There you go. She's been jumping. Look at her tail. She eats like four cups. I know. So give her that one too. Yeah. But and she gets tons of treats. Good. Very nice, girly. Good job. Good job. Little treats right there. She's thinking like I can. <laughs> Pro show tip number one is definitely always check out J and J Dog Supplies because they have these great and amazing deals on products. We just got these two Ruckwear harnesses, two for twenty dollars. up day one of our AKC Agility National Championship adventure and guys this has been a wonderful ride we've had such great runs with our dogs Daisy has done fantastic she did great in her practice run she queued or qualified she had a clean run in her premiere run and it was a very hard premiere run and now that that is over we're back here at the cabin and we're going to go explore what this place has. Tulsa, Oklahoma is beautiful right now. The weather feels great. So we're gonna go explore around this place. There's like a little pond down there that we might go check out, uh, pond, lake. I don't know the definition. You might have to let me know in the comments what that is, but, and there's like lots of other places to explore. The dogs are itching to come play. So we're gonna go ahead and go do that and bring you guys along for the ride. Oh, 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 um, and tomorrow, something very exciting. We're gonna find out if Daisy actually got some money. This is not a normal thing with AKC or agility trials in general. Usually you're paying out money and every once in a while there's some competitions where you get money back and Daisy might have beat out 134 other dogs to possibly win some prize money. I'll let you know about that next time. So 
our uh, adventure out here at this wonderful place was a huge success. The dogs got into the water, they had a great time. This is probably really good for Daisy to kind of cool down some of her joints and muscles to get ready for tomorrow. Um, it was a great way to kind of give her some therapy, but we don't want to overdo it, so we're going to have to go back up and close out for the night. Thank you guys for joining us here on the Doggy Dojo. If you have any questions, put them in the comment section down below. As always, have some fun with your dogs, and we'll see y'all next time. Bye.